Looks like this is the last of the seals, though. So, uh, yeah. Okay, Whisper, do your thing. This seems to be filling the entire city with an odd energy. If we don't shut this down, the city will be flooded with bad yokai. Let's fix up the seal. My pleasure. Uh-oh. Earthquake. Brace yourself. Oh, dear giant ugly yokai. Three-headed, no less. This is Slimamander. That thing looks really, really strong and gross. Power is surging through me. I'm finally released. You shall be my first snack in hundreds of years. All right, prepare for a first boss battle. Okay, right there, you just kind of saw that uh, Slimemander gave you a little bit of a hint as to what you're supposed to do in order to defeat it. The bigger batter yokai are known as boss yokai. You can't befriend boss yokai, but there are multiple places to hit them. Use your pins to focus attacks. Look closely to find out where to aim your pin. Always fight strategically. Okay. Now, we are going to be on the lookout for Slimemander's eye. There are th uh, it can be in any three of his heads. So, And the best way to um, determine which one it is is by uh, Sultimate moves that target uh, multiple targets. So let's go ahead and do the Pause of Fury. That'll hit all three of his heads. And it opened them up. Excellent. Okay, nothing in there. Nothing in there. Okay, the central head is his weak spot. Let's target that. Now, you don't deal damage to Slimamander if you're targeting his eyes when they're clo his mouths when they're closed. You only deal damage if you hit his eye. So, uh, yeah, that makes the battle uh, kind of tricky. But if you're clever enough, you uh, can get through Slimamander without any um, difficulties. Speaking of which, he's closing up again. Okay, let's go for a Cadence Ultimate now. Nice. Okay, nothing. There's the eye. Now, because we didn't actually open up the second, uh, the, the head on the right, it's, it will still be able to attack us. And Slime Mander, you sound like a turkey. S seriously, man. You're really intimidating and gross looking, but you have the weirdest cry. Okay, Jibanian Sultimate is ready again. All right, let's do this. Pause of Fury. You're going down, Slime Amander. Nothing. Nothing. It's in the it's in the middle head again. It's the third time in a row. All right, Tattletail. Give it to him. Big damage. Slime Mander, you will be going down soon. Just a couple more attacks. And there we go. See, Slime Mander is really easy if you know what you're doing. That was awesome. You guys rock. None of my uh, yokai were defeated. Excellent job, guys. Level up for everyone. And uh, we also got 10 bucks. Excellent.
All right, um, we were just saved from a uh, sneak attack by a ninja yokai. With uh, a two-headed scarf. That's uh, pretty lucky for us, I suppose. Otherwise, we would have been uh, roasted by Slimemander's sneak attack. We're safe now. Whoever that was pretty much saved us. I thought that was a friend of yours. Can't say I've seen him before, but hey, all's well that ends well, right? At least we can finally put the seal back in order. Okay, Whisper, this is all you. Oh, Cottonmouth, your confidence in me is really energizing. Oh, seal, heed my words, and now how about close sesame? And that's all done. The aura is gone. Hey, Whisper, is it possible these seals kept that giant yokai locked away? I can't say for sure, but I think there's a big secret hidden somewhere in Springdale. We'll figure it out. We've done a pretty good job so far, haven't we? Yeah, we have, haven't we? It's been a long day, Cottonmouth. Let's head home. Time to relax a bit. Okay. Finally got that chunk of the story done. And uh, let's save. All right, so it's uh, the day after we defeated Slime Mander. Excellent. Good morning, Cottonmouth. Time to wash your face and get dressed and brush your teeth. You were knocked out pretty good. You definitely earned a good night's sleep. You were great yesterday. That slime mander thing was really strong. What if another yokai that powerful would have showed up? Worrying is often an act of wasting one's energy, Cottonmouth. But in this case, it's valid. I think we'll need some stronger yokai. The stronger a yokai is, the better it is at concealing itself. We must upgrade your yokai watch if we were to find some stronger friends. Now, this is actually contradictory to what the anime says. It says that strong yokai actually have a lot of trouble concealing themselves. But I think it's kind of the other... I mean... I think the more logical explanation is what the game says, how strong yokai are better at concealing themselves. Because, I mean, if you watch the anime and look at Mangy Mutt, there's absolutely no indication about, like, whether he's strong or not. Like, if anything, he seems like one of the weaker yokai because of how often he gets, um, he gets arrested. Yeah, just... The, the anime and the game clash in quite a few ways, but in this case, I think uh, the game makes a little bit more sense. Okay, uh, let's upgrade the yokai watch, but uh, yeah, how do we do that? The watch shop is a good place to start, you know. If you have a watch you just adore, come on down to Timers and More. The shopkeeper's family has been dealing with yokai for decades. They're the ones who created the yokai watch, that's very interesting. We'll be in good hands when it comes to an upgrade. That sounds awesome, let's go. Agreed, timers and more, here we come. I remember seeing that place over by the Blossom Heights station. All right. Next chapter. This is getting pretty interesting. And of course, once we upgrade the watch, uh, we'll get to make more yokai friends and you'll get to see me uh, trying to hunt down a good deal more yokai. Okay, um, doesn't, like, right now, looking at the map, doesn't seem like there are any sub-quests for me, and, uh, Lidoni is just hanging around. Hey there, buddy. Now let's follow you. True to his name, uh, Lidoni will lead you places. Okay. Keep following him. And he will give you a little treasure box. What's in it? A book. Okay. I'll take that. Thank you. No way. No way. Come on, man. You can't hide from me forever. Seriously, man. Uh, 
All right. Let's head onward to Blossom Heights. It is a new part of the city that we have actually not been to yet. Uh, we'll be able to meet um, some different yokai there. Uh, def uh, not uh, all the ones we've seen uh, thus far, but a, a few new ones. That that goes. Um, that's especially true for when we uh, actually upgrade the watch. Okay, Blossom Heights. Here we are. Uh, timers and more is right down this path. Actually, what's in here? Oh, excellent new yokai, Dazabel. Da oh, three new. Popsicle, Dazabel, and Wan Wanston. Well, if we befriend one of them, that's uh, pretty cool, I suppose. I don't think I have any of their favorite foods, though. Whoa. That did a crap ton of damage. That is a seriously long, creepy tongue. Yeah, Chibanian definitely did not like that, being stabbed with an umbrella. What, what a weird way to go. Oh, wait, Wisp. Let's get this. And it's an item. That's uh, interesting. Level up for Tattletale. Awesome. No one wants to be my friend. Woe is me. Quite a few items to be had in uh, in this place. All right. Jibanian, seriously, now is not the time. There goes Dazabel. Oh, crud. Yes, aim, aim. Aim for Popsicle. Don't let him hit it hit us with Don't let him hit you with that. Nice. Jibanian. Taking him out right before you could get the Sultimate. No wisp that time, unfortunately. And hey, we got Wanston. Wanston is actually quite useful because it, it, he has an ability that makes it more likely for a yokai to drop an item. That's especially useful because there are some yokai that drop very rare items that you can use to get uh, even rarer yokai. So uh, yeah, Wanston, I think I'll put him on my team for now. I'm jealous of your friends. I want to be your friend too. Yeah, let's be friends with you, Wanston. Wanston. Pleasure to meet you. So yeah, we'll be sure to add him later. Uh, let's just grab these two items and then head to Timers and More. Milk. Never can have too much milk. All that uh, calcium and whatnot. Okay, timers and more. Right here. Here it is. Hello there. Welcome to Timers and More. I'm Mortimer Goodsight. What you need? Well, I had some questions about this watch. Let's take a look, see what we've got here. Oh, you've got yourself a genuine yokai watch there. That is a nice one. And who's the little yokai you dragged in here? I'm Whisper, yokai butler extraordinaire at your service. You can see him. 
Of course I can, I'll let you in on a little secret. I'm actually a yokai. See, some yokai like him take human form and join human society. Oh, I had no idea. Don't get many people with yokai watches here. How can I help you? Well, I need to make friends with some stronger yokai. Sure, sure. So you're looking for a total functional upgrade, is that it? That would be my pleasure. I miss working on these little babies. However, I'm going to need some special parts in order to make that happen. Let's see here. Yeah, I'll need a cog, a screw, and a spring. I'll call the bike shop boat the screws. You can just pick that up there. The cog I need is over in the old mansion. You should be able to find the spring at Wayfarer Manor. Okay, the cog at the old mansion, that will um, take a little bit more time and effort to get. So that probably won't be in this recording session, but I'll go ahead to uh, the bike shop to pick up that screw or what have you. Housers at Timers and more. Oh, hey there, are you the one running errands for Mr. Goodsight? He called us and said he'd be here to pick up a screw. Kind of a rare piece. That screw is hard to find in these parts. Don't lose it on your way back. That is a weird looking screw. Okay, uh, next is the spring. So yeah, I've like the number of yokai, the number of new yokai we're encountering is uh, definitely going up. Uh, so far, like yokai I don't have so far are Peck Pocket, Ruff Raff, No Way, uh, Dazabel, and Pupsicle. Um, I'll be sure to grab those on my own time though. Okay, uh, how do you know my name? Uh, old Man Morty from Timers and More called and told me everything. You're here for the thing that goes with the other thing, right? Take it. Okay, perfectly ordinary looking spring. I can feel it. You got one righteous air about you, kid. It's almost as if I can see how much you really love yokai. Oh, wow, another person who can see yokai. I've got an idea. This place, the Wayfarer Manor. So it's actually a far out zen spot where yokai from other cities can hang loose. But here's the thing, I need someone to manage the property for me. Managing stuff like that isn't managing stuff like that just isn't my bag, you know? With all that yokai love you've got, I feel like you'd be perfect for it. Plus, it, I, it's super laid back. I'm saying that as the manager of this place. You should go converse with some yokai from other cities sometime. I'm in no hurry, so let me just let let me know if you're interested in taking the gig. Wandering yokai will visit the old Wayfar Manor. Wandering yokai are yokai that visit Springdale via street pass. When wandering yokai appear, they will reside at Wayfar Manor. If a wandering yokai is there, you'll see an icon near the door. If you talk to the yokai, you may get a gift. You may also get into a fight. Occasionally, a wandering yokai will befriend you after a battle. However, you cannot befriend a rare, legend, or S-rank yokai. Use street pass as much as possible to meet wandering yokai. Yes, street pass. There is one particular yokai that you can only get by using that feature. So, yeah. Doesn't look like there are any uh, side quests for me here, but that will probably change once I uh, upgrade the watch. Uh, there is someone over here. Who is it? Oh! New guy. I think. Do you like rice balls too? I think you do. This is Pandal. Pandal's an interesting yokai. He makes you uh, very careless. Which, uh, yeah, that's quite interesting. Uh, I might as well... Uh, I only got one rice ball left. I'll have to pick up some more. Come on. Is a wisp going to be coming sometime soon? Ah, uh, probably not. Ah. I'm not going to get the chance to um, purify Caden. Alright. And we got him! 
Awesome, we got Pandal. Guess I should have been more careful. Well, whatever, let's be friends. Pretty cool. Okay. So the um, the mansion is right over here, uh, but there is a yokai nearby. I want to see who it is. Where do you go? Oh. Where are you? You move fast. Wow. Oh, it's Caden. <laughs> All right. Okay, uh, this is the mansion, and... Oh, there's something shiny. Where's the... Grab the shiny thing, yes. Dancing star, okay. And a small X-Borb, okay. So, I think this is where I should call it quits for this recording session. Uh, I'm glad we got quite a bit of stuff done. We befriended a ton of brand new yokai. Including um, a couple that we saw in the last recording session. We also defeated our first boss, Yokai, and completed the first, or the next little bit of the story. And next time, we'll be going to the where, way far, or the old mansion to grab the last piece for our Yokai watch. We will upgrade said Yokai watch. And uh, yeah, we'll just complete a whole bunch more side quests and befriend some more Yokai. I'm looking forward to it. But, um, in order. I'm going to continue the trend of me swapping between my two playthroughs. So uh, next time I post videos to my YouTube channel, it will be for Pokemon Black. So I hope you look forward to that, and I hope you look forward to the next installment of my Yokai Watch playthrough. So farewell, many great goodbyes. This has been Cottonmouth255, the Spore Serpent. Thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you again soon for more Yokai Watch. See you later, have a good day, and take it easy, my friends.